Van Nistelrooy, hit it! Oh my god, he's fucking... I really want this card, Nistelrooy. He's in, he's in, boys. Should be an easy go. He's got the pace to hold him off. All right, guys, and welcome back to Race to Glory. All right, guys, you've probably read the title. Don't worry, we've not gone and done the SBC. He is like two fucking million, okay? Bullshit. Don't worry, we've not wasted all our coins. There was an 82 loan card out in the SBC. It was about 10k for 10 games, which I thought was fairly reasonable. So yeah, we did do the loan card. We have so far played four games with him. We scored five goals. He helped us get gold two, which is really cool. I want that red messy badly, so I'm glad we did get gold two for those extra red cards. But yeah, he was pretty insane. His shooting is amazing. His heading is unreal. Anyway, let's jump into his in-games real quick. Three star, three star. I like to have weak foot. I'm not too fussed about skill moves. I know a lot of you guys will want skill moves though, so that will be a massive turn off for you. However, despite having a poor weak foot, his right foot is absolutely unreal. So I suppose that kind of makes up for it. And the biggest thing with this card, there is a huge pace upgrade. Do you have any idea? How fast I am. He is plus three from his original prime. I'm gonna call these cards Prime Squared, I think. I've heard a couple of people call them Optimus Primes, which just sound crap to me. Prime Squared, I think we, we can all agree that that's a better name. All right, Prime Squared. I think he has a dribbling upgrade, I'm not too sure. I think he has a generally a really good upgrade. His dribbling though is really nice. His really good shooting as well, 96 finishing. <laughs> I wish he had better long shots, but that finishing is unreal. He has 88 strength, which is awesome. 91 heading accuracy. This guy is a force in the air. Overall, a really good card. I wouldn't recommend it because these prime icons, they're so expensive. Do the loan, though. See if you like him, and then I would recommend his prime card because his prime looks nice. These prime squares, man, they're, they're too expensive. Okay, guys, let's just quickly jump into our team quick. We've made a few changes. These aren't permanent changes. This is just for the episode or for the next few episodes. We've slapped in the red Duncan. Now, you guys wouldn't have heard of Duncan, but I, I, let me tell you, he's a pretty overpowered card. Obviously, I've got him in the Fat Champions rewards. I, I just threw him in because I he was the only Serie A midfielder I had, and I couldn't be bothered to buy a player. Real quick then, medium-high work rate. It's, yeah. Really good pace. Uh, finishing is by far his worst uh, stat. It's not good. I am... Disgusted. 84 long shots though, pretty nice. Really good defensive stats, decent physical stats. I wish he was a bit stronger. Overall, it's just a really solid overpowered card. Obviously, if you guys missed the last episode, I think it's the last episode, it would have been the last episode. We did pick up Cloud Makalele. He was an absolute beast in Weekend League. Loved him, loved him. Obviously, you guys are probably wondering where the hell is Sadorf. We have, unfortunately, sold Sadorf. I know, let's get some crying emojis. <laughs> He, we played like over 500 games with him, I think. He was a long time servant of the club. It was time to go. It was time to move on. I'm not going to spoil who we picked up instead. We're not going to do it in this episode. We'll do it in the next episode. But I think you guys, I don't know if you're going to like it. I I personally, I think it's a good change. But I, I, yeah, I'm not going to talk about it. Enough about the team, enough about the players. I think we should jump into a couple of games of Fuck Rivals with Van Nistelrooy. I'll be honest with you guys, this episode was supposed to be a Fuck Champions video. But that Makalele video took so long to edit that it was like... By the time I was going to record the Fudge Champions, it was like half nine. You guys have seen the Fudge Champions videos. I'm pretty loud, and uh, I don't think my mum and dad would have been too happy if I started recording at half nine. WHERE'S MY DEFENDING?! So yeah, we're just, we're just gonna have a bit of fun with Van Nistori and Fuck Rival. I promise I will get a Fuck Champions video done though for next week. Uh, I definitely will record next week, because it's been a couple weeks now. Anyway, let's jump into some gameplay with Mr. Nistori. Okay. Van Nistelrooy, just hold it up, lad. Finds. I was trying to pass to Boutra. It's gone back to Nistelrooy! Oh! Oh! Twelve seconds later. Nah, nah, not straight from kickoff. Oh, fuck off! Like, that's literally. No. Oh, great defending. Mano! Get rid! Oh my god, what's going on? What a tackle. Maka! Get rid of it! Why no? I'm pressing! I think you need to calm down. Little one, two. Lovely football. We can get across into Nistro. It's a guaranteed goal. It's gone out to Duncan, though. <laughs> what a hit. Duncan is sick. I'm telling you. Van Nistro, hit it. Oh, my God. He's fucking... 
Well, I really want this card. Boutra, hit that. Go on, lad. Oh, what a hit. Even on an history episode, Boutra's turning up. Of course. Good, good, good. Get rid. No. Oh, oh. I can see Boutra on the sweaty. We're going to play. Boutra, that was a shot. That was a fucking shot. Oh, yeah. Defend. No, no. Just like. Oh. oh, fuck off. Like, how? How has that happened? Oh, he's gonna get rid of that! Stop! No, he just ran straight through me! My, oh, my defending. My defense is butter. Everyone else's attacks. If you're a spoon or above, you get through my defense. You're a fucking idiot. Come on, lads. Like, we're playing like. We played. What is that? For Ron for Blanc. Where's he getting these players from? Tackle. Tackle! I'm gonna break it. I'm gonna. Are you fucking doing this in rivals? Are you this much of a. Oh, I'm trying to review Nistroy here and I'm losing my mind. Fuck off. I lost that goal, man. Are you joking? Am I actually playing Ronaldo again? Like, I've, I've, ha I've just had it. I've had enough of Ronaldo today. Come on. Ronaldo, piss off. I haven't got the energy for, for bullshit today, boys. No. I'm done. I'm done. I, I... Good run. Great run. Hit it. Good touch. Oh, what? Go in. How is it not go? Mr. Roy. Oh, ho, he's... oh, no. We had a... Oh, it's a lovely header. Torres, that's a great finish. I sent him for days with that fake turn. Oh, if only he scored it. Lovely pass, though, with his head. And Torres with a lovely finish. Oh, that's nice. Mr. Roy, he's in. He's in, boys. Should be an easy goal. He's got the pace to hold him off. Mr. Roy, redeem yourself. God damn it, redeem yourself. Mr. Roy. What the hell? Mr. Roy. Mr. I, uh, is it taking a bit? Maclay, what the fuck? What? No, not like that. Oh, I fucking hate this game with a with a passion, with a passion. Uh, I'm Mr. I, you owe me, Dutra. That's how you finish, Mr. I. That is how we finish. A few inches later. Nah. 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 Oh. This has been one of the worst displays of defending I have ever seen in any any episode of the Rage to Glory so far. If I lose this game, I'm, I'm actually quitting. Like, I'm just not playing this game anymore. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Fuck off. I'm done. We're done. We're done here. What is this game? Nistor, you can redeem yourself here. If you win this header, it's not gone to him. It's gone to... Why is he not locking on to him? What? I don't want Torreira doing magical scissor flips. I need a minute. I need a minute from this game, to be honest with you. I need a minute. He has two million coins, Van Nistelrooy. You've got two million coins. Buy R9 Ronaldo. And don't waste your money on that absolute waste of space. Garbage.